Hello, my name is Philip Mwanga and welcome to the first of the Beyond Flesh and Blood developer videos. In this series we aim to explore gameplay elements and features in our upcoming title. So in this first video we're going to deal with signal strength and signal towers like the one up ahead. The player's character is a remotely controlled robotic suit. Now because of the interference caused by the last war, signals have a hard time going through the atmosphere. So towers are used to boost the signal. Now it's fine at the moment as we're standing next to a signal tower, but when we move from this to the UGR base, we will start to experience interference. As you can see, I'm starting to lose the signal, but it comes back once I'm in range of the next tower and we can carry on into the base. The player's role in the UGR is an engineer, so you'll spend a lot of time at the start of the game in camps like this setting up the infrastructure so that the UGR can begin to reclaim the Earth. Now, as we try to move on to the next location, we can't because it's outside of signal range. Thankfully, somebody's already set up a tower. So, I'll turn on the tower and the interference will lift and we can proceed. Now, what do you do if there aren't any handily placed pre-existing towers? Well, one of your jobs is to build new towers. Thankfully this is the future, so it's done like this. And with the tower deployed, we can turn it on so we can move forward. I hope you enjoyed this video, and in the next one, we'll cover suits, powers, and abilities. Thank you for watching.